on guys, my name is David and I'm coming at you guys with a brand new top 5 Ninjago video. In today's video we are going to be diving in to the top 5 saddest moments in Ninjago's history. I hope you guys enjoy this video. at number five is Nia's death. Now this one is a touchy subject since she technically didn't die, but it was still a very emotional moment and the highest point in Ninjago's sixth season. I'm sure everyone was still a little bit sad when Nia died, but then overwhelmed by happiness when Jay's final wish reverses it. <laughs> Taking that number 4 spot is the Sensei Wu and Pai Thor deaths. Now this one is also a very touchy subject since both of these characters are still alive today, but at the time this scene was packed to the brim with emotions. We didn't know if both Wu or Pai Thor would be returning, and honestly I'm sure that all of us felt bad for Pai Thor even though he was the main villain of that season. <laughs> Coming in at number 3 is Moro's death. Well, to be more specific, the second death of Moro, since he originally died as a human in a cave. But the second death that we actually saw in the show was a very sad scene, especially when Moro finally came to peace with his sensei, only to plunge into the water and perish. <laughs> At number 2 is Garmanon's sacrifice. Now I'm sure that a lot of people thought that this was an especially emotional scene in Ninjago's 4th season. Even though Garmanon was a villain throughout most of Ninjago's seasons, he did eventually redeem himself and decided to sacrifice himself after realizing all of the pain that he had caused in order to save the ninja and his son. <laughs> And finally, taking that number one spot is Zane's death. Yes, yes, I know, another touchy subject. When will someone actually die permanently for once in this show? Well, other than Garmadon, of course. Can we all have a moment of silence for my boy, the legendary Garmadon? You will be missed, buddy. But on to Zane. This was the first time that a member of the ninja team actually sacrificed themselves, and this left many fans in distress. A very, very sad and emotional scene, and I do believe that this deserves the number one spot. But of course, what do you guys think about my list? I'd love to hear your opinions down in the comment section below. Thank you all so much for watching today's video. I really do hope that you guys enjoyed it. And as always, please leave a like and subscribe for more LEGO Ninjago news coming to you guys each and every day. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll catch you guys in my next video.